Hello, my friend. Welcome back to Smart Farm Tech Channel. Do you know what farmers have to do to grow those fresh, sweet fruits? And how are those fruits processed in factories to become the products you love? Who would believe that millions of tons of vegetables and fruits can be harvested so quickly? From the vast fields, modern machinery has turned hard work into a joyful experience. Today, let's explore the journey of these familiar crops, from the hands of farmers to your hands as consumers. You'll gain a deeper understanding of the connection between farmers and consumers, helping you appreciate the products you use every day. Are you ready? Let's get started. Have you ever wondered why tomatoes are harvested in the summer and early fall? That's because it's the perfect time when the tomatoes are fully ripe, offering the best flavor. Have you ever tasted a freshly picked ripe tomato from the garden? It's an incredible experience, right? That sweet, cool flavor is absolutely amazing. The US and China, two agricultural powerhouses, lead the world in tomato production. With nearly 12 million tons of tomatoes harvested each year, the U.S. is truly a tomato superpower. And have you ever wondered how they managed to harvest millions of tons of tomatoes so quickly? The answer lies in advanced technology. Modern harvesting machines don't just gather the whole tomato plant, they also handle unwanted parts like leaves and stems. Look at these machines, they're truly impressive, aren't they? The tomato plants are neatly cut and the automated system gathers everything all at once. It's incredible how thousands of tomato plants can be harvested in just minutes without manual labor. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss our next videos. This not only saves farmers time, but also ensures precision and efficiency in the harvesting process. But it doesn't stop there. Automated sorting systems are even more amazing. Using high pressure air, these machines can quickly and precisely separate leaves and stems from the tomatoes. Even the ripe and unripe tomatoes are sorted using airflow ensuring only the best tomatoes move on to the next stage of processing. Isn't it incredible how these machines work so efficiently and precisely, maximizing the tomato harvest? Next, we'll visit Pear Farms in Washington, the state with the largest pear growing area in the U.S. 
with a production of 347,000 pounds. The fall season is also when the pears are ripe, sweet, and ready to be harvested. With the help of modern technology, pear harvesting has become faster and more efficient than ever. The ripe pears are gently picked from the branches and sent to processing facilities. During the harvesting process, specialized equipment such as hydraulic lifts and mechanical harvesters is used to ensure a quick and careful collection of the fruit. Workers utilize hydraulic lifts to reach high branches, gently twisting the pears off to avoid bruising. These machines can collect multiple pears at once, minimizing the time spent in the orchards. Once gathered, the pears are placed into bins that are transported to processing facilities, where they are sorted, packaged, and prepared for distribution. These fresh, delicious pears quickly reach consumers. American pears are not only tasty, but also have high economic value, making a significant contribution to the country's agricultural economy. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss our next videos. Next, let's head to California's grape farms. When it comes to grapes, Napa Valley is renowned for its premium wines. In 2023, the revenue from grape production and winemaking in Napa Valley was estimated in the billions, significantly contributing to California's total agricultural revenue. The hilly terrain, combined with warm days and cool nights, provides an ideal environment for grapes to thrive, resulting in high-quality grapes with rich flavors. Grape harvests typically occur at the end of summer, when the grapes reach optimal ripeness. After harvest, grapes are carefully transported to wineries for the winemaking process, which includes pressing, natural fermentation in oak barrels, and aging in cool cellars to develop complex flavors. Finally, the wine is bottled and aged further before being ready for global markets, offering drinkers exquisite California wines. Taking a sip of California wine, you'll be transported to a whole new world of flavor, sweet, deep, and full of rich aromas. It's a taste sensation you won't forget. Finally, we'll visit a large beet farm in Michigan, where millions of tons of beets are produced in 2024. Common beets in the U.S. include white and red beets, with white beets often grown more due to higher demand. The beet growing process in Michigan starts with preparing the soil, making it soft and well-drained. Then, beet seeds are sown in the spring and carefully tended throughout the growing season, including watering, fertilizing, and pest control.
Beets are usually harvested in late summer or early fall. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss our next videos. The harvesting method uses modern machinery, which speeds up and improves the efficiency of the process. Modern beet harvesters can lift beets from the soil, clean them, and package them right in the field. After harvesting, beets are cleaned and stored carefully. Then they're packaged and sent to stores. Beets are a valuable crop for Michigan and the whole U.S. because they're in high demand and produce a lot. The American agriculture industry, with its scale and modern technology, has greatly contributed to providing agricultural products to the global market. The impressive production numbers we have seen in this video truly show the strong growth and efficiency of American agriculture. Which part impressed you the most? Feel free to share your thoughts with us. Thank you for watching the video and see you in the next video.